Hello everyone, you are in Endurance Laser Lab. Today we are presenting you a new MO2 PC board by Endurance. This is our board itself. First thing we want to show you how we made calibration mode and protection mode. So when you plug in your power to laser box or laser control board, it will be 1.5 second delay and also it will be minimum laser power. Let me show how does it work. So you see the lamp started in minimum power. It happens when your switch is in second position. So if you want to return laser to full power, you need to turn it off and then on again. Look. Now it's full power. More important that we added an additional protection circuit in our Endurance MO2 PC board. Some of our customers faced a problem that the CDC had an expected voltage jump and that could actually break the laser diode. So we added this protection into MO2 PC board. So how does it work? Let me show you. For example, we have 4.64 volts on DC-DC output and uh, let's do an experiment. So let's increase the voltage on DC-DC and you'll see how our PC board will block and will stop uh, the power that goes to the laser. Show us. So we're screwing potentiometer, increasing voltage. You see it's increasing, 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 and suddenly stop. So on 5.2 volts we have limit, we can actually change it. When your uh, whole entire circuit will be stopped. So it means that you have an exceeding voltage on your DC-DC converter. So now we can return it back. Let's return it back and you will see that it will start working again. So now you see it's working. Okay, let us show you how we can actually adjust this voltage limit on our MO to PC board. Show us. So we screw potentiometer, we increase it, let's increase it on maximum. Okay. And now we will exceed voltage on the CDC and you see it, uh, the lamp just stopped on another level. So um, this maximum limit will be set up, set up on our PC board uh, later when we get more information about all laser diodes and we'll make it probably closer to 5, uh, maybe 5.1 volt pretty much the same as we have on Zena diode. So this thing actually replaces Zena diode. Now let me show you how we made an analog input for CNC machines. So as you know that some CNC machines they have analog uh, output where you can regulate your power from 0 to 10 volts. Let us show you how we made it on our Endurance MO2 PC board show us so you see the power on the right uh, the voltage and we're actually changing it and you can see due to ratio on oscillograph so the oscillograph is increasing you see due to ratio and the voltage is increasing on our uh, voltmeter and you see the lamp burns much lighter so this is about our analog input. We added another protection from uh, higher voltage input. For example, you have analog input from 0 to 10 and for example, you make 24 volts. So let's see what happens. 
actually nothing. So our laser model will be protected from unexpected voltage. Also it doesn't uh, matter if you miss polarity on your TTL or analog. Uh, miss polarity and uh, have more than 24 volts. So everything will be working. So no problem with that at all. So another thing I want to show you how we made an inversion mode. So what does it mean? For example you have a CNC machine where you have 5 volts that turns off your router, your spindle and two volts that is actually turning on your spindle. So let me show you how does it work. So we're increasing. So when we hit certain limit, it's actually 3.6 volts, that it will turn off. So it means that any voltage you have less than 3.5 volts, it makes um, your system working, so you have uh, power and when you exceeding 3.5 volts that is actually turns off your system. Okay, let us show you how TTL mode is working. Show us. So we have a limit before that voltage uh, the laser the system will not working and after we hit 0.7 volts so TTL will work with a minimum 0.7 volt and then you can increase up to 24 volts so TTL will work so like I said before if you miss polarity nothing terrible will happen so you see that we missed polarities in our wires and now we are actually adding uh, power okay show us and nothing nothing actually nothing bad is happening so the circuit will will work i mean it will not operate but uh, nothing bad you will not burn circuit if you miss polarity even with 24 volts so that is a good thing First of all, I want to thank our customers for helping and support and a few customers that are going to take this MO2 board and do some tests. So uh, we will present MO2 board uh, very shortly on the market and it will be available. So hope that you like this video and you hope, hope that you like our Endurance MO2 PC board. Please stay updated with us, subscribe on our channel make posts and comments. Thank you. Bye-bye.